So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury and joining me here, our expert, Jim Beglin. Thanks for that, Peter. Hi, everyone. The excitement has really picked up now and I'm eager for the action to start. So off we go then. Modric, Isco, Cointrao, Real Madrid are on a great run. Five wins in a row. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Iaramendi. Pumps it forwards. Modric. Out towards the flank. Where to from here? Isco. Modric. Pretty cagey early on from both sides. Spoon forward. Now the pass. Now here's the through ball. Chance to shoot. And he won't reach that. Good run. Ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Midway through the first half, and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern, and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end, it'll have been forgotten. And it's Bale. Bale can't hurt you with his back to goal, and I think if they can keep him facing in that direction, then the only thing he can do really is to just lay the ball off, and, and he's not really going to cause much trouble if he continues doing that, so I think they're defending him very, very well. Benzema gets flagged offside. Cristiano Ronaldo has been in fine form lately. Very fine form, I would say. A run of games is definitely helping um, a personal run of success now, and he can do little wrong. He's full of energy and enthusiasm. It's all going great. Isco. Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah, the defence had him exactly where they wanted him there. Didn't even give him the space or, or the room to turn. And I think if they can keep him facing the other way, then his threat becomes a much lesser issue. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Modric. And it's Cointrao. Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. Crunching tackle. He's thrust his way through. Real Madrid emerge unscathed. They were right up against it. Modric. Carvajal. It is a corner. Keeper's ball. 
If you have just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Decent looking ball. That's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Cristiano Ronaldo. With the ball through, Isco. Fabio Cointrao hurtles into the tackle. Cristiano Ronaldo goes pelting down that left-hand side. And back out it comes. And it's Iaramendi. Chance to shoot. And it's a goal! And for such a big name in your side to register very close to the break, not only creates a real buzz in your dressing room during the break, but dispirits the opposition too and, and sets up a decent chance to go on and, and finish this game to their liking now. Cristiano Ronaldo simply wasn't going to decline an invitation like that. He knows that they've got the passers in this side that will find them. And his job was just to make sure he didn't stray offside. And it worked an absolute treat. Real Madrid take the lead, 1-0. Listen, it's... And the referee brings the first half to a close. So there was the first half. Oh, what a great time to score that is. There's just no chance for the opposition to come back at you. Real Madrid leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments. It's 1-0 at the break. Here we go again then. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Modric boots it upfield. Aimed long and direct. That's gone a long way up and away. Sergio Ramos. Cristiano Ronaldo. Driving on now. What can they conjure from here? That had everyone off their seats. And that was more than a decent attempt. Perhaps it deserved better too. There he is, making his presence felt. Yeah, he's definitely a player who looks like he could make something happen every time he's on the ball. He's just full of belief and energy. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Daniel Carvajal. Iaramendi. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Modric so still just a goal between them he's off on a marauding run it's in two to the good they have breathing space that has brought the house down what a wonderful hit oh, the contact was fantastic right on the bootlaces and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike Real Madrid get themselves a two-goal cushion. 
Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. That'll be a throw-in. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Cristiano Ronaldo, Modric, Benzema, caught offside that time. Gets it upfield. Isco. Tries the route one option. Real Madrid desperately needs someone to hold up the ball. An absolute thunderbolt! A finish right from the top draw! And surely that settles it! Well, no goalkeeper would keep that out. It really was a bullet. Yeah, I just thought he made great use of his upper body there. It would have taken something really special to keep that out. Real Madrid take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Pumps it upfield. Sergio Ramos positions himself well and cuts it out. Oh, he's come flying in. Well, that's where he wants it. Daniel Carvajal. Bale tries a through ball. It's a loose ball. Back in once more. That's well blocked and back out it comes. He's in. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Cristiano Ronaldo! They are running riot over the hills and far away. No catching them now! Absolutely thundered in. Keeper, no chance. That is just the top drawer finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly, and they don't know how to stop him. some activity down on the touchline it seems there's going to be a change
Who's going to make this theirs? Cristiano Ronaldo. James Rodriguez passes it through. Goalkeeper's ball. Goes long and forward. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. And he's made certain that won't get through. Fabio Cointrao tries to get it forward quickly. It was all about the quality of the delivery, and they come away with nothing. And Pepe. Another piece of really good defending. Fine defending there. It's a long forward pass. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Played in with accuracy. He's had a shot. It's in. Goes for it. Keeper gets just about enough of it. Confirmation that there will be four minutes stoppage time. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Neither side really getting hold of the ball. Pumps it upfield. Pepe does well to read it and intercepts. Rafael Varane. In comes the delivery. They've done it! A lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Four in the game. He is the man. Real Madrid totally rampant here. And that will be the final act. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Oh, listen, if you've got that kind of power and, and that kind of pace in your team, I think you'll plough through most teams. Those central areas tend to be very congested, lots of traffic going on, but it wasn't a problem for them. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.